Hello there, welcome to my channel, my name's Richard. So you're looking to put a white border around an image in Photoshop. I'm gonna show you my favorite way, it's super quick, and it can be done in one click. Okay, let's jump right in. So first thing we need to do, obviously, is to open an image on Photoshop. So you can open an image multiple different ways. Um, whichever way suits yourself you open it up okay so once Photoshop opens you want to unlock the background layer by clicking the little lock icon there next step is you go up to image click on image click on canvas size and um, select centimeters that's the way you want to work and width of two I normally go for height of two check relative check the relative box is clicked and uh, that is centered and it's okay. Once you do that, you present it with a, a little checkered box around your image. Next thing you need to do is to make an adjustment layer by clicking on the adjustment layer icon in the bottom right, select solid color. You want a white border, um, just go with a white color. You can pick whatever color you want, but I'm going with white. Hit okay. Next step is to drag this new layer below your original layer. So click it, hold your finger on the mouse button, drag it down and drop it. Now we're nearly there. Last step is to flatten this image. So you go up to layer and look for flatten image. Now the entire image has been created, uh, layers have been put onto one image. So that's the process. Next step is to do it in one click. Hi, well if you're enjoying this video and it's anyway useful, be sure to leave a like, comment and definitely subscribe. I'm an outdoor photographer based in Ireland. I do a lot of outdoor vlogs. Also some tips and some equipment reviews, so be sure to subscribe. Right, let's get back to it. Okay, so want to do it all in one click as promised. So let me show you how. We'll use the action function for this. So I'm gonna go into history here, go back to the start of the process. So we need to generate an action that will record all the steps and allow us to do create a function and just one click, we can get what we want. So to do that, you go to window and you select actions you'll get this little box panel here you want to create a new action so you go down to the panel hit a little x button you want to give it a name so i'm going to call it border then you simply hit record and start the process so record first step unlock background second step image canvas size centimeters two to hit OK, adjustment layer, solid color, white, hit OK, drag below the original layer, and finally go layer, flatten image. Now you hit the little red or the little box to stop the recording. Now we've generated a function called flatten image, and let me show you how it works. Again, using the history, I'll go back to the original. Here's your file, when it photo, when it opens, I can go into my actions, this little box here, go to button mode, it's easier to see what you're doing, and you'll see a little command here called border. I just simply click that, and there you go, white border. Benefit of this as well is, if you click it twice, three times, four times, you'll keep getting larger and larger borders. So this can be useful for posting on Instagram. Again, this also works with portrait images. So here we have a portrait image opened up. Again, single click on border and it'll put a white border around it. If I want to post this on Instagram and get the whole image in, I might want to make a large white border. So three or four of these borders, two, three, four clicks. Now I can export that image, post it on Instagram. The image size itself might be slightly smaller, but you'll get to see the whole portrait image on Instagram. So hope that was helpful and make sure like i said to like comment and subscribe see you in the next one